three, two, one, click. We're almost Welcome done, audience. Don't part. worry. Thank fucking Lord. <laughs> the worst is almost over. This is the final episode of Twin Dilemma. Are these like the worst episodes in Doctor Who history, or are there worse? It depends on who you ask, but I, some people and I consider it the worst. Okay. Well, so at least we can take solace in the fact that after this, it, it can only go up. Yeah. And, you know, and, you know, I'm sorry. For as much as people can hate the likes of Love and Monsters, that smells better than this. They've got Perry. It's like, he, it's like the actor got drunk. Wait a minute. Oh. How do we end up back here? Again, recap. Oh. Perry! <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I love the, the show doesn't do a very good job of um, telling you that this is a recap. <laughs> and yeah. Uh, yes, you, audience, the only reason the slug guy's keeping Perry hostage and not killing her is because he's, she's pleasing to him. Even though they're an entirely what? different species. Oh my god. Great, as if the episode wasn't bad enough, now we've got, um... Okay, I've got nothing against, like, interspecies relationships in TV shows, or any form of media, but this is not the right way to do it. Not at all. Like, for... Well, Wait a minute, does that mean you're fine with 06? No, no, he's as, as... fine... He's fine with it as long as it's well done with taste and stuff like that. Yes. I see. God, she, or do you think it, I'm it, that it, 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 depend, <laughs> it, it depends on how it's done. Like, for example, your Watch is actually going to pull one of those, except they even pointed out, bec uh, uh, you know, how unusual it is, and they do it with taste, so. Hmm. I... 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 Uh, okay, you know what? Fuck it. I, I've given. I've completely given up on trying to make sense of this. <laughs> Something about calculations and blowing up stuff. Yeah, and I'm all. And I also have homicidal instincts. Yeah, I strangled two people nearly to death. What? I'm turning to proof, my lord. Seriously, what? Can they just put like a microphone underneath that mask, or have him dub over it in ADR? I don't know. You guys still there? Yeah, we're yes. here. Yeah, I'm here. Hey. Yeah. Uh. Okay, and now he kills him for some reason. Because I. Again. Oh no! Wait, he didn't. No, he didn't kill him. He just for, tortured his forget mind. Forget it. Forget it. I'm done. Uh, again, I'm done. I'm. I'm not even going to try at this point. Okay, okay, okay. I will, in the twins' defense, despite their god-awful acting, the script isn't doing them any favors. True. Okay, um... Oh, he's taken off the mind control thing-ish. Thing. Oh, thank God they took his awful jacket off. Oh, boy. Wait, at least he won't be blinding us every time he's on screen. Or well, unlike these two. The Doctor still has his clown jacket, though. He, get used to it. He's like this throughout his entire tenure. Oh, boy. And even Colin Baker himself wasn't fond of the design. He wanted a more darker outfit. They're the villains.
Yes, we're going to play um, <laughs> Tetris. Oh boy. So this is the Tetris movie before Tetris movie actually comes. Any more words on that, by the way, Dwarves? No, all we know is that Food Fight people are making it. Which is in no. Which, again, uh, that movie's gonna suck pretty much. <laughs> I mean, how exactly do you make a Tetris movie? That doesn't even make any sense. Of all the video games, why Tetris? One of my friends that is, is probably going to be like one of those science movies where the only way to stop the end of the world is by by using a code and you get that code through Tetris or some shit. <laughs> There's a, there was supposed to be an Heavy Rain movie, uh, but it never came why? to be. Why? <laughs> because of the success it had back in 2010, but I'm guessing it eventually petered out. And uh... Okay, guys, pay attention to what science they try and use in this. Death by what? Hmm. Even the doctor's bored. We're all we all are. What happened? Uh something. Jovis Jovis here, guys, what should I do? Uh just tell him we're busy and we can't really okay. You know, since it might as well finish this. Heck, I can stretch to another half an hour for Rise of Lyric. This is it, guys. Oh? What I is thought it? you were talking about the, the way science. they science. The science? What science? Okay, when the happening has better understanding of science than you do, you just... So let me get this straight. Uh, um, something to do with Decaying the orbit and cra the planets crashing into the sun. I honestly, I, I, I don't know what happened there. <laughs> the writer and the script editor had no idea how science worked. <laughs> I love Joba's reply. Never mind, I'll wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, try all you like. <laughs> Joba doesn't want wait, to be what? <laughs> How did you break into the TARDIS? You need a special key. I, uh, you, know, you know what show f your episode you know, fuck you <laughs> uh, I honestly that <laughs> I don't know <laughs> Is that supposed to be a joke? Maybe. Of course we're wasting time. We're watching this thing. Yeah, sure. Doctor, it's Twin Dilemma. There's no such thing as answers in Twin Dilemma. Okay. No, they're just rubber. <laughs> the eggs are dry. Hmm. That's what's wrong. Pretty much. Oh boy. No, Perry's right, he is talking in riddles. Huh. 
Um, really? It just looks like a bad map painting to me. <laughs> yeah, that bad painting reminds me of the um, the backgrounds in the higher frame rate version of the Hobbits. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even kidding. The the back some of the backgrounds in that movie, the high frame rate version at least, uh, were look just like that. Like uh, really, I'm 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 I'm, I'm not even kidding. That that was one of the most mind blowing experiences I've ever had going into the cinema. I never thought I would watch a movie in 2012 with that level of that looked like that level of production value. <laughs> Like, for example, uh, there was a moment where you were watching a waterfall, and to me, it looked like just a, a wall painted blue. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, audience, this episode's so boring, we're talking about The Hobbit. Well, what, again, I've, I've completely given up. I have no idea what's going on, so can I... <laughs> Out of Shadows. Guys, Daily Motion crapped out. What time are we at? 12, no, sorry, 11.19, 11.20. Go to 11.50. Mm -hmm. I'm at 12 minutes. Okay. All right, please cool her in, Dwebs. Oh, well, don't worry. Um, wait, how did that happen? Okay. I honestly... Uh, Debs, maybe you should clue Shiro in. Don't worry. Well, did you say 12 minutes? Yeah. Well, you've got 10 seconds left for that. Okay, just reminding you. Okay. And three, two, one, go. Okay. So the doctor was just collecting piss. Be because. <laughs> that's, what it, that's what it looked like. How much do you want to bet? Uh, it was the director who, or who had really had to take a piss, and the, and that's like uh, okay. He, let's just put it in the into the episode somehow. Yeah. <laughs> yes, master. Autobots kill them all. Yeah, I wish I wish I was watching Transformers Four. Like, uh, I can't even believe I'm saying this, but yeah. <laughs> there you are. <laughs> um, villain, aren't you going to ask about what he's hiding behind his back? Yeah. How didn't the guards notice that? <laughs> because because the plot demands it. The plot, uh, quote unquote. You are. Okay, Doctor, maybe a... Force field, and with a terrible sound effect. I know. Doctor, it was a force field. Wow, I think at least one character uses common sense. <laughs> <laughs> you might throw something at me with that. Activate shields. Because you sure, because you sure, because you sure as hell can't use your lot for anything else. Oh no, we shoot. They're shooting at each other with fireworks. Just shoot him now. Shoot him, you idiot! <laughs> uh, if you wait. shoot him, the episode will be over quicker. Wait, what's going on now with him? I don't know. You're supposed to be the one that actually knows what's going on. Oh, I don't even know. 
He just got indigestion. He said in the last part he didn't see the whole thing. He did? I don't know. No, 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 no. I have seen the whole thing, just not in a while. Oh, I see. Yeah, so much. He's trying to strangle two people to death. Embolism time. <laughs> okay, that line was pretty funny. Uh, at this point, I'm, I'm just. How? I'm in there. How's he gonna do that? I says, when have they ever established that he can invade people's mind? I don't know. Um, okay, so now I s Don't you just love delayed reactions? Oh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> that is so unconvincing, it's scary. Oh my god. I... <sighs> Contain... <laughs> now you can't... Okay. Wait, where did I don't know. <laughs> Wait. Wait. Uh, What's what? happening to them? Um, like, I... disintegrating? <laughs> what am I watching? Um... I honestly did. <laughs> Famous last words. Re regenerating? I mean, I know he's a Time Lord, but... Uh, I... Uh, <sighs> so, regenerate then. Yeah. Um, okay, don't regenerate them. Bring regenerating up, but don't do it. Um, I, I don't, uh, so what, he's psychically linked with him? No shit, he's dead, we just saw that. Is this supposed to be emotional? Yes, <laughs> but I don't feel anything. <laughs> Nobody does, I think. Nobody did. But he was never brought up before. I'm like, I thought Barusa was like your mentor. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm, I'm explaining stuff Pedro hasn't seen yet. It'll make sense when we get to those episodes. Will you marry me, Doctor? <laughs> uh, speak up, I can't hear you. No, I can't even. <laughs> I know you're dying, but speak up a little. Um, okay, he's dead. 
I'm gonna say something Five? really. I'm gonna say something really controversial. I felt more sorry for Ed from after last season. <laughs> I wouldn't blame you. I mean, how? I mean, I at, at least during that part of the movie, the movie was still uh, was still very funny to watch. So it was. Uh, how how did they get it open? You can only open it with a soddy cipher in dead key. This is so. Oh, uh, uh, okay, so they broke in there, but they didn't know what to do. So that was entirely pointless. This entire thing is entirely pointless, so... Well, there was a point. They were trying to introduce the audience to the new Doctor, but, well... It's done a very terrible job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> is, and is this the most hated Doctor? Um, well... Or... Well, sadly, yes. Well, although, like I said earlier, he has gotten a better reception in the um, big Finnish audio productions. <sighs> Are we done yet? <laughs> I'm so fucking tired of this special already. Give me, give me George Lucas's political debates over this. Honest, I can't even believe I'm saying this, but I agree. Give me some Star Wars prequels right now. Honestly, I. Uh... At least that's fun. At least even when that gets bad, like it's fun to make fun of. At least. Uh... Well, at least to me, anyway. But. Depends on what particular parts of the prequels are talking about. When it when it comes to your defining, it pisses me off. When it comes to the moments like um, the love dialogue's hilarious. Yeah, the love dialogue's hilarious. But uh, I hate what they did to Yoda. I hate what they did to Anakin Skywalker. It, it depends that on. That being what, said, it, all that pales in comparison to this, in my opinion, yeah. because they turned the Doctor into a psychopathic killer. In like five minutes. Yeah, we'll need it too. If it's, if... Goodbye. Are we going to go yet? Jesus Christ. You said goodbye twice. I would ask what he's going to do, but I don't really care. Who cares about him? <laughs> oh, Pedro is alive. <laughs> Another planet, huh? Despite the fact that I strangled you to death nearly. The episode's over. I am so glad we're almost this done. This is over. Well, I don't like it. I'm going to express my thoughts in the form of a question that I brought up in part It's two. over! Um, All right. Why didn't these four episodes completely ruin this franchise for good? Well, well, that's here's my because it's lots of shit. Here's my final thoughts. Uh, well, that was a pile of shit. <laughs> yeah. Well, okay, I this is one of those very rare things where I cannot name anything that was good. The acting was atrocious. The music is awful. The plot makes no freaking sense. The sets, not just and, the music, the sound effects as and well. The, I mean, the, the sets and you know props look so freaking cheap. And I know this was a bottle episode, but come on. And also, the villains are utter jokes. Um, the characterization... What, what the hell did they do to the Doctor? <laughs> they turned him into some arrogant, pompous prat who nearly strangles two people to death. 
pretty much, yeah. Fuck this episode. But yeah, audience, we've dealt with the worst. And Fuck it with things, a stick. Things can only get better from here, right? Yep. Hopefully. So we'll see you the next time we do a Doctor Who episode. See you then. See you then. See you then. Thank goodness. <laughs>